All right, so uh, we just finished our Cyber Slam, our robot battles. Refer back to that video and check it out. And we're starting to get together and think about our second one. And we're upping the weight to 25 pounds this year. And me and Tommy and the other guys are actually sitting around the night looking at ordering some parts. And I couldn't help but do a quick tip on this. This is actually something I got today. I went by the Walmart. And I hate to plug Walmart, but these are the cheapest drills I have found. And they're not high-end drills. They probably have plastic gears in them, but they're they're going to be good for our entry level. And this is what I'm running in my machine. But that's not the only thing I want to talk about with these drills in this quick tip. Because there's some added bonuses. Now I'm looking at this from the standpoint of a battle bot. Like y'all know, or most people know that are into this, drill motors are great for battle bots. Now these are 18 volt NICAD drills. And the price is 1873. And please comment if you found them cheaper, but this is the cheapest drill I've found. I was looking at it and thinking, because I have better batteries I'm gonna use for my robot, and I'm thinking, well, I'm getting a drill motor, and what else can I do with this? This is what you get in the box you get the drill you get some nice instructions and you get the charger drill battery charger and a bit that's what you get in the package for 1873 so i took this one apart there's the motor and the switch and all this is what i'm going to be using in my robot pretty much just this but you get in this for anyone that uses parts you get a free drill chuck you get that bit that you can use uh this you can use as a power supply this puts out 24 volts at 0.24 amps so it's a good little power supply but here's the real quick tip not thinking about robots the battery it's an 18 volt NICAD battery well, you take this battery apart you have this now a lot of you may know this already these are pretty standard that you see in any NICAD rechargeable drill battery unless you've got the shorties in yours now drills we use are primarily these DeWalt's and we have them uh, this is actually a 12 volt, but with slight modification, and I may do another video on that later. The 9.6s, the 12s, the 14.4s, you can pretty much modify them to take any of those batteries, as we do here. We've got some 14.4s, some 12s, some 9.6s, and as you can see, this is actually a Black & Decker battery. You can modify it to take the DeWalt or Black & Decker batteries, but that'll be another video. What I'm getting at is, you can see this drill is working great. This was a battery that would not hold a charge anymore. It would hold the charge maybe 10 minutes. What I did, I took these batteries, clipped them apart, reoriented them in the correct fashion, soldered them back together, and rebuilt this battery. So my point in this long-winded speech is, for $20, Basically, you can rebuild one of your good batteries if you're not using the battery that comes with the drill. You can rebuild one of your good batteries that's not taking a charge anymore. You get a robot motor and some other stuff you can do things with. The trigger, this is a, I think this one's pulse width modulated. Um, the power supply, free chuck, and a free bit Phillips and slotted 20 bucks I mean it, it's a pretty good deal these are probably not gonna be your best batteries but if you're buying it for the robot motor which is what we're doing this is just a freebie you're getting a free battery and this is an 18 volt so you can rebuild up to an 18 volt drill with this no problem this is a 14 4 so I had three batteries left over but to me, that seems like a really good deal. I hope it does to you. These are uh, 1,200 milliamp hour batteries, by the way, which is not quite as much as a, a DeWalt battery, but still, for a, 
a battery you're going to toss because it won't take a charge. You're going to have these. Make a comment if, if you found drills cheaper. We'd like to know these, like I said. Uh, you know how Walmart is. They might be gone tomorrow and never have them again. That's happened before at Walmart. But as of right now, at least in my area, they're 18 and some few cents. They do have the same drill with a lithium ion 18 volt battery, but you're jumping from 20 bucks to 40 bucks for a cheap ass drill. My quick tip for the day, go out and make sure Walmart knows that we want these things. <laughs> Maybe they'll keep stocking them and we can keep buying them for our robots. I am I am going to take this apart at some point and see. I'm guessing there's this probably has plastic gears. For this price, I'm sure it's a plastic gear gearbox and I'll pro hopefully I can get I'll get this apart and make a video on that, but if not, you can do it for yourself. I don't think you're going to find a drill cheaper than that. I've checked Harbor Freight, Northern, a few other places that are always good for cheap stuff and haven't found it any cheaper. So, quick tip of the day. Not so quick tip of the day. That was a quick tip. That was quicker than Dave's quick tips. I mean, look at that. Isn't that sex on a stick?